Hey guys, so welcome back to another video. Now this is gonna be a Halloween themed video, which here I am making a Calavera, a Day of the Dead school. And all I'm doing is using a nail swatch stick and a nail form, and I'll just place the nail form around the swatch stick so it could get that kind of curve as your natural nail has, or your fake nail. And um, yeah, so here I placed the bead of black acrylic. And this is going to be the background of the school, where the eyes are at and the nose. So I'll shape it out. I'll put the circle on the top and kind of like the square part in the bottom where the teeth are going to go. And then I'll start putting the, a white on top of it. Now before the white sets, I'm going to come in with just a little dotting tool and shape the eyes out. And my dotting tool, I dipped it in the white acrylic so it could just help it not get stuck to the acrylic. But then I go back and dip it in the black so it could give it more definition. And don't worry if it kind of looks kind of funny, you are going to go over it with acrylic and shape it out more. So I'm using this really thin uh, dotting tool here and I'm just forming a little triangle where the nose is going to go. Okay, so now I'm coming in with a really small bead and I'm just shaping the forehead part where like the eyebrows are at so it could have more of a like pop out kind of look to it. So I'm just using small beads and just kind of like curving it out and then I'll reshape the eyes before the acrylic dries. Okay, so moving on to the mouth. I am gonna be working in two different beads, the top part and then the bottom part. And I'm gonna be forming the first one as a little rectangle. And then I'll come in with my cuticle pusher and make the little lines where the teeth would be. And then after that one's dry, I'll go, and not all the way dry, but semi-dry, I'll come in with the second bead and do the, exactly the same thing. Okay, so as I'm working here, before it completely dries, I'm going to form the teeth and kind of make them more aligned and reshape it into the little square look. So once I'm satisfied with the way that the little teeth look, I'm going to go ahead and pick up like a black bead of acrylic, but wipe it on a napkin and whatever is remaining on my brush, I'm going to put it around the school so I could give it more of that little aged look. So once I have let the school dry for a little bit, it is ready to be used on your nails. So all I gotta do is pop it off with a nail form. I'll just give it a little nudge and it pops right off. And yeah, this little school here took me maybe like five minutes to do. It's really simple and really fast. You just have to have patience. But this is it for the rest of the video. I really hope you enjoy it. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I will see you all in the next one. Bye!